All right, folks, we're in Arches. The truck is right there at the campsite. And this is how we start our hike. Yep, just heading right out from the campsite. There will be people on the trail. Hopefully we'll get past most of them. There are several side trips out here, so not everybody goes all the way. There's water and restrooms at the trailhead. And we are gonna head out this way. Definitely a popular trail, and it is gonna get hot. It might get up to 100 today. Definitely be like mid-90s. We're hoping that most of these people will be cleared out by the heat. Just got a nice picture of Ranger Jordan. I was excited that we're gonna put him on Rangers pointing at things, and we're gonna get started hiking. We just asked him, there are rattlesnakes out here. Not many, but it is possible to get bit. Someone got bit at Del Delicate Arch last year. Well, this is amazing. Nice breeze today, too. There are a number of side hikes. Pine Tree Arch is down there somewhere, but we did that last time. And there are a bunch of people out here, but it's thinning out already. Everybody's pretty well spaced out. Oh, wow. So we've got an arch there. And then, oh boy, landscape arch. Look at that. Beautiful. And we're going up the primitive trail section. Gotta look for cairns, it gets a little rougher. It's a little steep, not too bad though. The slick rock is very grippy. It's gonna be a steep climb. Took a nice break in the shade, hiking again. Yes, there's another side trail to some more arches over there. And we're gonna keep going this way for now. It's flattened out up here in the pinyon juniper forest. Up on a fin, we got a big view out. Roxana is not enjoying this, but she's doing it. Roxana, what'd you think of that? Were you scared? Um, a little. You did it though. She's a champion. There are cairns, it's not too difficult to find your way, but you do have to pay attention out here. It's easy to get thrown off trail. Double O arch. See, there's one, and there's two. Double O arch. It's a really noisy family over there, so we'll just look at it from here for now. Pretty cool. And we're gonna continue on this way a little bit. Uh, typical for the parks, as soon as we sit down to rest in the shade, here come the chipmunks, there's even a bird over here. All the little critters start creeping in on you, looking for food. This is why you really can't feed wild animals in the parks, because they become so aggressive. Here comes another one, and there's a bird in the tree here creeping on us. And 92 in the shade, not so bad. Nice and dry out here. Really quite pleasant to hike in for us anyway. Well, we sure shed the crowd out here. There's still one or two people making it all the way out, but most of them stopped a long time ago. We're about to head to the Dark Angel, and from here it looks like the white part there is the angel, and the dark part is the wings. But as we get closer, no, that's not the case, and the name makes no sense at all. Obviously, they're nowhere near each other. That's pretty neat. All right, and we've made it to the Dark Angel. Look at that big monolith. And we're just gonna hang out here for a little bit and see if we can figure out some of the other side trails. Pretty cool.
And the advantage of being heat tolerant, we've been out here, it was about half an hour ago when we saw somebody down at Double O Arch. And we haven't had, seen anybody out here for a while now. Just us. There's a nice look at Double O Arch. Some of those storms we were seeing in Capitol Reef must have hit here. There's a little water. And we're making our way maybe to Private Arch. We're not really sure if we're going to get there or not. It's getting hot and we're pretty far out there. We have to turn around pretty soon. But there is another big arch there. And it's just a beautiful walk through here. But not too far up ahead, this primitive trail gets really difficult and on narrow edges and stuff. And we're just not going to do that today. It's too hot. and. We've seen a lot out here, so let's we'll go a little further and head back. Okay, because as is, we've got about a five and a half mile total. Um, private Arch must be somewhere way down there. This is a really cool view. That's an amazing fin, just that right there. Look at this little divider. And yeah, I can see people way down there. And since we're not going to go back that way, we would have to come back up this way. It's just too much. It's almost a hundred out here. We sure had an excellent hike though. This is beautiful. And there's still a couple little things to see on the way back. Arches. We have done it now. Yeah, we really feel like we've seen the park. After this one, huh, Roxana? What do you think? Yes. Tough though, huh? It's hot. It is hot. At least there is little bits of shade here and there to hide out in. Excellent. And I love it. We get to walk right back to our campsite. We don't have to drive anywhere. All right, we'll show you a couple more things on the way out. Well, there's a deer right along the trail, just doing a little browsing. Walking on the slick rock. One last little hundred foot side spur here to the black arch overlook. There's a little bit of an edge there, but safe and secure. All kinds of stuff down here. This one was a little confusing, but after some research, I'm pretty sure that's Black Arch there. All right. From here, it's basically just back to the trailhead. Another fantastic hike. Thanks for coming with us.